It's Pride Month, and the Big Brothers Big Sisters of Broward are here this week to talk about their big Pride initiative, specific to the needs and vulnerabilities of the LGBTQ plus youth. And we're joined by Jennifer Becker, Vice President of Programs for Big Brothers Big Sisters of Broward, and Jason Jenkins, Senior Vice President of Communications and Community Affairs for the Miami Dolphins organization. Happy to see you both, guys. Welcome to the show. Thanks for having me. Jennifer, I'm gonna start with you. Let's talk about the Big Pride program and what is it and how does it service and affect our LGBTQ plus youth right here in South Florida? Absolutely. So in Broward County, we have 50,000 LGBTQ students and those students are telling us and reporting that they're not safe, they're not comfortable in the school environment. And we wanna make sure they know that they have allies behind them. Hence our Big Pride program. That's wonderful. I, it, you know, it starts, I wish there was programs like this 10, 20 years ago that that were being of service to, to our impressionable youth because that's exactly what they are there and they are impressionable and they're dealing with things that they're not used to and are looking for guidance. So thank you so much for having this initiative. Jason, I want to send it over to you. Glad to have you here this morning. Why has the Miami Dolphins Football Unites chosen to support the Big Pride program? Well, you just hear that with Jennifer just uh, laid out. I mean, our goal with the Football Unites program is to improve relationships, foster understanding, and provide opportunities to experience the South Florida culture. We work with about 40 to 50 different organizations that make up the intersection of this community, not only to amplify their programs, but also bring them together to do those three things that we just mentioned. Right, right. You know, all three of us right now, we're on television right now, which gives us immense power. And we have such a privilege to connect with thousands of people that are watching. And I want to just drive home that, you know, this year is the 52nd anniversary of the Stonewall Riots, which is the reason why we have pride. You know, it's a celebration of happiness, but it's also founded in doing right and, and making sure that people are seen as human beings and not second class citizens. How will Big Brothers, Big Sisters of Broward and Football Unites participate in Stonewall and the Stonewall Parade, Pride Parade this year? We are thrilled to be walking in the parade and with the Dolphins partnership and support of our program, it sends a message to the community that we stand behind our children, that we defend our children, we are allies with them in this particular event and that we can walk proudly. Right, right. Where can we go to find more information on the Miami Dolphins Football Unites, Jason? You can go to our website, uh, miamidolphins.com uh, backslash football unites. You'll see that program. And, and like Jennifer said, we're excited not to be only, this is a great show of uh, our support and amplifying our efforts. But I think what's more important is big sisters of big, big brothers and big sisters of Broward County are involved more than just about pride issues during pride month and the same thing with us. We wanna be uh, making sure we look at this as a 12 month initiative and doing what we can each and every day to support our youth. I, I couldn't agree more. The conversation around supporting our LGBTQ plus youth and just the LGBTQ plus experience is a 365 day a year thing, not just a 30 month, one month thing in a year. Um, thank you both so much for the work you're doing. And thank you so much for chatting with us this morning on Inside South Florida. Thank, thank you. you.